Day two in beautiful Morocco, the flags are out waving, we're here. Visit Morocco have sent me here and they put me on a bunch of objectives to do before I go to the next match. <laughs> of Tangier, you can actually see Spain. This across the sea is Spain. I think if I train, I could swim from Morocco to Spain. I think I could. Tell me in the comments. This cat's diving. Minty is good. The company is even better. Whenever I go somewhere, I like to appreciate it. This needs no introduction. You can see for yourself. Now I've got some Moroccan sweets that I want to show you. Some of these are very well known in Morocco and I need your opinion. I've got the dates. Bonbon. Now I feel Moroccan. Now after trying Bonbon. Bonbon. We've got the Bebeto. These are elite. Apparently these ones are meant to be exceptional. We've got dinner time. Let's see what Moroccan restaurants can offer. Oh my God. This is going to be good. Moroccan restaurants do not disappoint. Even sushi. Morning, Queen. Welcome to our next day here in Morocco. We're heading out of Tonja right now. We're going to visit a new area called Tatuan. I've never been there and I'm really excited to see what it offers. Wow, we are in Tetuan. I didn't think it would get any more beautiful. We've got a guide and we are walking around the Tetuan Old Town here. A new city for me. This is going to be an adventure. Traditional marketplace here in the Old Town of Tetuan. Look at me, my new Corona. Welcome to Morocco. Now I have the full outfit. I feel Moroccan now. This is my tour guide today, Hamid. Great to meet you. Yes. Fist bump, Thank fist you. bump, yeah? Yes. Okay, let's have a look around Tetuan, yeah? Yes, Tetuan. Yeah, that's good. Welcome. Thank you. Welcome to Tetuan. One question. Yes, together. Do you like my outfit? Yes, very, very, very good. <laughs> you, are, good? you are Morocco now. Tetuan is absolutely stunning. We're just taking a look. We've got the old city behind us, the new one in front, and the weather's gorgeous. The new outfit's ready. The beautiful Orthodox Catholic Cathedral. Behind it, the synagogue and the mosque, and this is like a running thing with the, the towns here. They always have the religious areas together. They welcome everyone. Wow. So we've seen the new city and now we're going into the old city. We've got the food market and then clothes market and then electronics and then anything you can find. They all sell it here, it's crazy. I'm next to Kimi, I'm telling you. Mint tea time, eh? Peace. Wherever I go, I drink a mint tea. This is the sweetest, yeah. Mm. It's like chickpeas. It's like a 7 out of 10. I don't know what's Marhaban big. Marhaban. This guy, he started do doing the dance. Hala, hala, hala. <laughs> what a guy. How does everyone know me? Look at the design in here. It's incredible. I'm going to have a soup. Time for Harida. Harida. <laughs> Harida. Mmm. Bizem, bizem. This tagine de couscous. The plate, this name tagine. El couscous. Wow. Similar couscous with the chicken and mixed vegetables, spices, mm. color the saffron. Sir, 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 You've got mountains over here and you've got Tetuan. Thank you for the adventure. Yeah. It's too early, it's too early. It's about 7 a.m. We're about to get a fast train from Tonja to Rabat to watch the big match, Riedad Casablanca against Al Halal in the FIFA Club World Cup. Here we go. So in England right now, you can't even catch a train. They're all cancelled. And in Morocco, you could get from one side of the country to the other in one hour 20. The super fast train. Let's go to Rabat. Here we go. Assalamu alaikum, Rabat. We begin the day at Adnan Tower Mosque. Look at this. <laughs> Look who we found. Unbelievable. <laughs> He's back. Look at this. Look who we are. Yeah, I know. Special, That's spiritual, crazy. right? You're leaving Morocco. You're making the wrong decision. <laughs> I am making the wrong decision. <laughs> yeah. I out to my job, I would love to stay here. I got work to do. Yeah. I gotta go back to real life at one point. Beautiful site here. Complex Muslim Muhammad V. 
I mean, some of the designs behind me, the effort put into it, I think it was complete in the 1970s, open to pray here. So spiritual and yeah. as wide as possible. You go down every street and it's just stunning. You got to see across from here as well. So you feel the winds, it's a little bit cooler. Mm. It's beautiful. Okay, we've come to an old bakery again. They're making a fresh bread. Take a look at this. They stick it inside the stone oven. And you try the bread here. Job done. Okay, here we go. I, I can't believe I got, it's still, look, it's that warm you can see. Mm. It's perfect. Right, we've got the main man here. We're in a house, we're about to have food with everybody. And we're about to like, just enjoy what it's like with Moroccan food. We're gonna get stuck in. It's gonna be an experience, right? You are welcome. This is Jersey. Traditional. Moroccan traditional yeah. architecture. Nice. So it was, uh, it was distributed for free in Qatar. And this is for you. No way, for me? Yes. Thank you so much. <laughs> it's my size as well, he knows, he knows. Oh my days. This is just insane. We're about to have the traditional Moroccan meal. Before watching We Dad, we're doing it right. <laughs> the only thing I picked up is the meat. I just want to give it a review. Standalone food there. Mm. Nearly a 10 out of 10. Here we go. I'm ready. Lunch is complete. Now we head to the stadium. My school prediction today, We Dad are going to win. Let's find out inside the stadium what happens. I'm going 1 0. Who's Sani to score? Let's see. We did is just gonna see it out 1 0. Same as me. Same, I like that. I like that. What are you going for? Score? 2 0. 2 0, yeah? Okay. Yeah. We've got the shirt on. The weather is unbelievable. It's about 18, 19 degrees. I've come all the way from England just to watch We Dad, to watch this game, to experience it. Let's do it. Yes. Prediction today. Uh, I'm going to say like 3 0. 3 0. 3 0 to We Dad. Oh. Coming to the stadium. We're getting stopped everywhere. <laughs> the love is insane. It's so nice to see. Okay, this one. Come on! <laughs> the golden ticket. One more cue and we're in. Let's do this. Let's go! Welcome, thank you. It's great to be here. Thank you so much. Legend. Everyone's super nice. So the fans, they've all got whistles, like they did in Qatar, which is what separated Morocco from the rest. They would always whistle. When the opponents were on the ball, they'd be whistling, whistling, whistling. Kick us off. The only Al Halal fans in the stadium. A small pocket of the Saudis in blue and white. It's all kicking off between the African champions and the Saudi champs. Kick to Al Hilal. Wait. Delwin. Delwin. Oh, doesn't get closer than that. That's half time. Wow. We done. Very solid half. They look the better team. The fans are in like out of this world. I've never experienced anything like this in my life. Igalo kicks us off for Al Halal. They got Johnson, yes! Stop these 
Chinese fans and they're leading. We dead one. Al Halal nil. The Saudis are in trouble. 62nd minute here. Good chance for Al Halal. Marega stepping over it. Or not. Whee. So to everybody in England, they didn't think the Club World Cup was a big deal. Look how much it means to these fans. They are holding on for dear life. But if they do it, it will erupt. In the 89th minute, a penalty is awarded to Al Hilal. He's sent off, he's sent off. He's sent off a Weedad player. We're still waiting into additional time now. They've given 11 minutes. 11 minutes additional time. And back to silence. It's 1-1. One, one. What a save. Kept them in it. Full time here. And to be honest, it looks like neither team are going to score. And we're now underway for extra time. They've just given a red card to an Al Hadal player. It's 10 versus 10. The train's back on. Surely not, in the 120th minute. Oh, no! Oh, no! Penalties it is. Well, the penalty shootout's in our half. Marega up first. He puts it away, 1-0 Al Halal. To make it 1-1. No. Off both posts and not in. Heartbreak for Weedad. Could have been closer as well. Great pen. No complaints. The number 10 for Al Halal scores. He has to score. He has to. And he does. 2 1. This place would erupt if he missed. Oh, this time the post equals a goal. Oh, that is inch perfect. 3 2. He squeals, he's gonna miss! Oh no! He squeals, he's gonna miss! Oh no! Oh look at him as well! He's giving it big! He's getting booked for that! He scores and it continues, he misses, Al Halal win! Nice pen! Well it always comes down to one penalty and it's this! If he scores, Al Halal win! A bang and deathly silence. We'd had crash out of the Club World Cup. Absolutely gutting scenes. But one thing's for sure, these are some of the loudest ultras I've ever witnessed in the world. Moroccan football is so underrated. And the fact I was in that stadium for the match, I was over the moon. Thank you for watching this video. Let's get 15,000 likes and I will go to the next round. We've still got Al Ali. We've still got Real Madrid to join us. Morocco will still continue to put on a show. Thank you for watching. We'll see you all in a bit.